What's going on guys, in today's video, I'm gonna break down exactly how this website right here is making over $180,000 in passive income. That means that the creators of this website are making money while they sleep. And what we're gonna cover in this video is what this website is, how they make the money, because that's the most important part, how do they get the traffic to make the money from this website, how long did it actually take them to go from zero to $180,000 per month in passive income? I'm also gonna add a bonus in to make sure you stay to the end. And I'm gonna explain to you how you can get started as well and you can start your own website online that makes you money. The information in this video is information that I found online. It's free for anyone to view. I found it on the creator's other website, income reports and traffic stats. So we're gonna go through all of this in this video and you'll understand how much money can actually be made online and how crazy it is. I know, nearly $200,000 in a month, passive income is crazy and I know it seems unachievable, but it can be achieved and you don't actually need a lot of skills and you can be a complete beginner to actually do something like this. So let's jump into my computer and I'll explain to you exactly how this website makes their money. All right guys, so the first order of business, what is this website and how does it kind of work? So this website is called dollarsprout.com and it's a website based on finance, money and things like that. So if we go to this page, you'll see that it's a very, very nice laid out website. I'm gonna talk more about that later because the layout is actually really important on how they get traffic and it does matter quite a lot. So we'll talk about that a little bit later in this video. But what I wanna show you is kind of what they talk about. So they talk about making money, they talk about reviewing products, they talk about business ideas, how to start a blog, work from home jobs, money management, banking, investing, and it's really the go-to website when you wanna search for information based on these particular topics. And that's why it's such a great website. And you'll see here that they also collect email um, addresses as well, which we will talk about later on in this video and why that's very important as well. But this is just a basic website that's laid out nicely and they talk about specific topics and they make money by talking about these specific products. So that brings us to the next thing. How does it make money and how do they make money every single month from this website. Well, it's actually quite simple. So what we're gonna do is go up to here and we will go to how to make money, which is one of their topics. Now, inside this particular blog post, we're actually, I'm gonna sh show you how much they actually make. They make an insane amount of money per month, but we see in this particular blog post, which is laid out extremely well, really nice, we see that there are links here. Now, if I click on one of these links, which I will do, so let's say Postmates, and I click on this particular link, it's gonna take me to postmates.com. However, if we look at the URL up here, it's got a referral code. So what happens is these guys get what we call an affiliate commission when people click on these particular links and they have lots of links in all of their articles. And so there's another one here. This will be an affiliate link as well for a particular um, product. This one here is Acorns. So this is an investing application. And if we click here, it's also a referral code. So if somebody signs up to this particular application, they will get an affiliate commission. They will get a percentage. It can be 5%, 10%, all the way up to 50%. I've even seen some that are up to 70% of whatever the person pays. And that's one of the main ways they make their money. Now, they also make an, uh, money in another way, which I'll talk about in a second. And they probably do have other ways they make money. But I would say that most of their income, if not pretty much all of it, is coming from affiliate marketing when they place links. Now, they also do reviews. So if we go to make money and we go to say survey junkie, uh, junkie review and we scroll down, they've done a review on a particular product. So when someone searches survey junkie review, this could pop uh, come up on Google or wherever and they can click on the links and there's just links everywhere and these are affiliate marketing links for affiliate products. Now you can, um, a lot of people always say to me, how do you find these products? How do you know which ones are the best? Well, literally anything usually has an affiliate marketing um, program or some sort of referral system. So for example, if I go to shopify.com, I'm in New Zealand, so shopify.co.nz, and I scroll down to the bottom, it's always at the bottom. It says affiliate program. So they have an affiliate program where they where you can go out and promote this particular product. Now, if we go to one of my um, products here, this is one of my products, and we scroll down, I also have an affiliate program as well, and I pay people a commission. So that's what you want to do is you want to go to 
basically anyone um, has has an affiliate um, program. So if you're going to go and do a review on a particular product, or you're going to just link out to a website in one of your articles like these guys have done, you can make money by doing that. And there's also a great website called clickbank.com. These guys um, have pretty much programs, courses, software on any particular um, niche. And you can get paid an affiliate commission for promoting these products as well. So that's another great way to go out and find affiliate marketing products. There's actually networks out there that are specifically designed to have a lot of products that you can promote. So you can promote any of these products, um, how to sing, surfing, make money online, anything like that. And it's all in one place. However, you don't want to get kind of overwhelmed and things like that. But this is just a great example because if we go to like any of these topics, if we go to how to start a blog, they'll be making money by links as well. So if we go down here, um, they've probably got a link here. So uh, how to start a blog on WordPress using HostGator. If we click on HostGator, it takes us to HostGator, which is a website hosting platform, and they will get a commission every time someone signs up to one of these, they will get a commission or some sort of referral fee for this platform or website. And it's a really is a great way to make money. Now, how much do they make? That's kind of probably what you're really wondering is how do I know they're making so much money, hundreds and thousands a month? Well, if we go to this website here, this is actually their website um, and it's created by these two guys here. So these guys um, breaking the 1% are the creators who created Dollar Sprout and they just blog here about their kind of other things and blog here about Dollar Sprout. And if you go to actually, if you go to Dollar Sprout, let's go back to Dollar Sprout real quick. You'll see at the bottom, they have that website listed there. So that's one of their brands. Now they do what they call um, income reports. So if we scroll down, they actually said that in January 2019, so they're probably making well over $200,000 a month now with Dollar Sprout. They made $180,000 in, you know, in, in uh, revenue. So that's like affiliate marketing, which is probably most of it, and maybe a few other things as well. And they had $50,000 in expenses. So their profit was $130,000. And you might be asking, why did they have $50,000 in expenses? They do, I, I think they spend around about three to 4,000 a month on Facebook ads, but most of their expenses go towards article writers. So they have a team of people. If we actually click on here and we go up to their, uh, I think they have, um, yeah, a link down here, our team. They have quite a large team, so they have to pay these people to write content for them. So that's why they have um, expenses and stuff like that. But their overall revenue in January 2019 was $180,000. It'll be well over that. By now, it'll be well over $200,000 per month, probably a lot more than that. Now, how do they actually get the traffic? So this is really the most important part, and this is where a lot of people get stuck. How do they get traffic to this uh, website, dollarsprout.com? Well, it's actually all laid out on this blog as well. So in their income reports, they actually say where they get their traffic from and all that sort of stuff. Now, most of their traffic comes from search engine optimization. So in this particular um, screen here, this is a brand new browser here. I put in how to make money online fast. And if I scroll down, they actually have the snippet box here. So this is their website here. But if we scroll down again, um, their website is here as well. So 25 best ways to make money online for free. Now, pay attention real quick. We're going to cover two or three things that here that are really, really important. Number one is you'll see that there's keywords here, how to make money online fast, make money online, earn money online, and make money online fast here as well. And they also have make money online for free in here and then best ways as well. So if you put in best ways to make money online, they'll come up as well. But this is structured extremely well, okay? So that's the first thing I want you to notice. The second thing I want you to look at is it says jump to best ways to make money online fast. So that's another article on their website. And then it has other links down here as well. Now you'll notice that none of these other websites have any of those links. Right, so Dollar Sprout's kind of standing out. Google's like, hey, we're gonna, you know, show all this other stuff as well. Why is that? Why is that happening? Well, if we go back to dollarsprout.com real quick, you'll notice that everything is structured nicely. Everything is in mega menus. It's structured nicely. Everything looks good. It looks nice. It works well. This is what Google wants to see. Google wants to see nice, clean websites that are structured well, they look good, they feel good, everything links to the right pages, 
And this is why they are ranking. And this is why Google has gone out and basically um, ranked them for all of this stuff and got all these different links here because it's structured extremely well. Now, if you don't know what search engine optimization traffic is, it's when someone searches for something like how to make money online fast. And then they go and click on a specific website that's ranked in the top 10 or top 20. Sometimes you go to page two. But how does this actually happen? How do we actually get ranked on these particular pages, especially for this keyword, which is quite hard? Well, number one, guys, is they actually, if we go back to their website and let's say, well, actually, let's just click on this here. Let's open this up. Um, uh, they've actually got two. So they've actually got two ranked here. I don't know why Google didn't bring up that one there, but um, they've actually got two ranked here. So if we go to here, you'll see that it's really laid out quite nice. And they've got make money online fast in their headers. They've got everything laid out nice. They've got some images. They've got these boxes here with these reviews. Uh, they've got links here to other to related products. They've got links, obviously, to related articles as well, probably in their, in their um, website. But everything is laid out nicely. Google's basically got gone out and said, hey, this is a really good article. It beats a lot of articles online. This is what users want to see. So we're going to go and rank this in the top 10. And this is really critical for going out and ranking your websites or just ranking any website in Google. And there's a big misconception. A lot of people think, oh, I need backlinks and stuff like that or, or to build backlinks. Now, backlinks are when people link back to your article, but you don't actually need backlinks because you'll start to get them naturally as Google starts to rank you. But that's really the most important thing is you'll, you'll see here that they... Everything's just nice and clean and works well and everything like that. And they've got everything laid out. And you'll see here how to make money online as a freelancer. So if we put that into Google, it would probably come up as well. They might rank. I'm not saying they would, but you, they might rank for how to make money online as a freelancer. And then as we go down, um, they've got different sections. So now they've got become a web. Oh, sorry, that's one of the um, lists. But if we go down... Uh, they got ideas for starting an online business. So you see that they structure everything in specific sections on the article. They don't just do how to make money online fast and then list a whole bunch of ideas. They structure the specific ideas under the specific headings. And this is what Google wants to see. What, what Google does is it, go and just, it goes and takes specific uh, text from the article uh, that has those specific keywords in it. So make money online fast. That's search engine optimization, and that's what they use, uh, guys, to get all of this traffic, thousands of visits per day, to that website, dollarsprout.com. So now you might be asking yourself, how do we go and rank for these keywords? How do we know what ones we can go and rank for, things like that? Now, Dollar Sprout, we will talk about how long it took them to start making money, like they didn't start making money straight away, and it does take time to build up these search results and stuff like that. But what you can do is you can go to um, Google and type in Uber Suggest, and this website will come up, it's completely free, and you can put in some keywords. Now, what a lot of people do is they'll go, oh, I can't rank for how to make money online, which is probably true because you will, you'll be a new website. You won't have much authority. However, you can try to rank for other keywords like um, make money online with PayPal. Although it doesn't have a lot of search volume compared to make money online, you still get search volume. You still get people going to your website or article we have how to make, uh, sorry, make money in Google. So you can do an article on seven best ways to make money online with Google or something like that. But what this tool does, it's completely free. It'll spit out keywords and different variations of make money online. And it gives you easier keywords to go and rank for and that sort of stuff. So you really never run out of ideas. There's always lots of ideas to go and rank for and you never run out. We've got make money online as a teenager. We've got make money online games. You can do an article how to make money online with games. But that's what we do. We go out and find these keywords and we put them into these keyword tools and it gives us suggestions and we've even got related keywords as well and it will give us related keywords that'll pop up and this is actually quite slow it probably won't work or not it did work uh, and we got um, related keywords so how to make money online faster so we're quite lucky that we have all of these tools at our disposal to do this and make money now i do want to give you guys a quick little bonus on how they actually make money with another way on their website, which is really interesting as well. And I did kind of miss it up before. Now you'll see on these on this website, they have these forms. So they've got one here. If we click on one of these um, articles, they'll have a form on the side as well down here. Now, the reason they have these is because they want to collect emails. And then in the back end of these emails, they're going to actually go out and send 
affiliate offers and stuff through the emails and they can send a course if they like, if they want to create a course in the future. But it's really important to build up an email list from your blog if you start one because then you can send people offers, affiliate offers, maybe a YouTube video that you just released, maybe a new blog post that you just released or maybe a course that you want to bring out. It's really important to collect emails because you, you're building a community. So you join the Dollar Sprout community. You want to build a community so you can keep sending them offers, you can send them your blog posts. So you know you might have a new blog post and you might have affiliate links in it. So you go and send that blog post to your email list and a lot of those guys will click the affiliate links and you'll make money. Now, one important thing I do wanna talk about is how long until they started to make money. This is a really important topic because what a lot of people seem to think that you just make money online instantly and it happens instantly. Well, it's not really the case. And what happens is a lot of people will try blogging and they'll stop after a few days, they don't make any money and they'll give up. But if you just wait, I promise you, you'll start to get results. So these guys went out and started on February 2015. They didn't really make much money for more than a year. Okay, now don't don't um, let that put you off. You know, some blogs will make money a few months later. You know, we don't know. They might have put their affiliate links in, you know, a year later. They might have just focused on content. When, with my experience, I've started to make money around about three months later when I've had my affiliate links in the post. But what a lot of people do is they focus on content first, then they go out and put the affiliate links in. So that's what I would recommend you do is focus on content, then think about making the money later. That's really important. So it took these guys about just over a year to start making money. However, I don't know when they put the affiliate links in. But as you can see, it starts to rapidly grow really, really quickly. So, you know, the first month they started monetizing their blog, they did 17, well, good month, $17, $30. And then it goes all the way up and it keeps going. You know, it increases a thousand to two thousand dollars a month and increases and increases and increases. And now they've gone from sixty one thousand dollars a month in uh, 2018 October all the way up to a few months later, one hundred and sixty seven thousand dollars. And I suppose that is that profit they're talking about. Um, I'm not sure it's different to this, but they've gone up extremely fast to it just grows and grows and grows and it's a massive passive income stream now they could just stop blogging and they would still make a lot of money from the blog dollarsprout.com all right guys so that's a crazy amount of money and you can see how much effort they put in and you know they deserve the money but how can you get started doing something like this how can you make passive income online now what a lot of people think is oh it's too hard i need to get subscribers i need to get people coming to my site you got to remember that these sites started exactly where you are. They started with nothing. They didn't have any idea what they were doing. They just started writing content. So the first step for you to do is to start writing content so you can start making money with this, whether it be two months down the track, three months down the track, but it really is worth it. Think about it. If you can put in two or three months of time now to do this, and then in that two or three months or four or five months, you start making money and it could even replace your job. Would it be worth it? Of course it would be worth it. So you just have to put a little bit of effort now and then you'll start to reap the rewards later and you could have your own passive income stream. So to get started, the first thing you need to do is have a website. So what I'm gonna do is leave my free tutorial up on the screen. It won't cost you anything. This is completely free. And you can go and watch how to start your own affiliate marketing blog online. I'll take you through step by step. And I'll also leave a playlist underneath that's completely free as well. And it'll take you through how to make money with affiliate marketing. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button, hit subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video.